Here's an overview of a laser cut structure that I assembled and stained and painted. And this video is going to show you some of the steps in how we created this structure from start to finish using a laser cutter. So a couple months ago, my trained friend Caesar calls me up and says, you got to come over and check out my laser cutter. I'm making structures for the layout. And I have to admit, I had never really heard of a laser cutter before, so I didn't know what it was all about. So I went over, and the video you're seeing here is what I saw happening. He takes pieces of basswood or balsa wood and lays it on this laser cutter, and it will cut precision designs into and through the wood. Now first of all, he designs these structures on something like Corel Draw on the computer, some type of a program, and then prints it out to the attached laser cutter. Now by varying the power of the laser and the speed at which the laser is moving on the material, you can either cut completely through it or just burn or score marks like you see being done here. This will just be simulating wood on the side of a barn. And now the laser has been slowed down and more importantly the intensity of the power of the laser has been increased and it's cutting completely through the pieces of basswood. Underneath is a honeycomb structure on edge that keeps the laser from burning into the area that holds the material below. Apparently he was having some problems there with what was going on and complaining about it. By the way, you guys know Caesar from the O-Gage forum. His handle is Fatboy, and on YouTube his handle is Fatboy in PA. So check out his videos, and he has a really nice layout. And when it's done, you just separate the pieces and pull out the scrap. You notice the honeycomb structure has the table underneath so the laser doesn't burn through it. And here's a sample that Caesar himself actually assembled from the parts that he cut out. This was his first version, version 1.0, so it's gotten a lot better since then. I glued some dollhouse hinges on the doors and glued some clear acetate inside to simulate windows. So this is my first attempt at a project like this, so don't be too hard on me, guys. And then here's the finished version that I stained and painted that Caesar made for me. Thanks, Caesar. Really appreciate it. And you guys should contact him if you want to work out some projects to be laser cut.